Adam. Wow. All right. What's up, guys? Empowered Qs here bringing you some more League of Legends action. We are playing some Jax, of course, in the top lane. We're going against Trindamir. So, should be pretty fun. We're going to go Trinity Force into... Ooh, it's a Titanic. It's a Rage Blade. Just got a juicy trade against this Trindamir. Some level 1 Jax cheese right there. Um, my flash is blown because we got into a play earlier, which went well for us. So, happy day there. Sweet. That should be a level 2 kill. Alright, he knows that, so he's backing up. So I'm just going to slowly last hit, keep my Conqueror up. The thing about uh, Trindomir is you never want to fight him when he has lots and lots of rage. That's when he's going to have the it's highest on. chance to crit. Ooh, he just hit his level 2. Alright, 2 minutes and 40. Probably going to get ganked here pretty soon because I'm pushed up. That is the one downside of doing the uh, level 1 Jax cheese is you kind of automatically push lane. I think we might be able to uh, go up there. Might be able to dive it, but... I was telling Zach to go up in the bush, but... Oh, nice. Oh, get the attack! Nice, good job. Good stuff. Well, I knew Udyr was bound to come soon, just, uh... Not quite what I expected. So my Ignite's gonna be up in 30 seconds. Can definitely look to kill him then. He might be back in. Yep. I can't Bring stop him, so I'm just gonna push this wave. Okay. He should be TP back. If he doesn't, he's boosted. Ready nice. Battle. Oh, he did cool. He's gonna push it too, so. Jump back. Nice. Good shit. Um, I want a little bit of lifesteal combat stats, so I'm going to build a Dorn Blade. A shield here and a Control Ward. I've actually been stalking a decent amount of Korean players right now, and that's almost always their first buy. It's actually usually as early as three minutes, so I'm assuming they push those first two or three waves, get super aggro, use all of their potions, and go back for a Dorn's Blade and a Long Sword. It gives them a lot of nice combat stats. So, I think it makes a lot of sense, too. All these things are going to scale really nicely, so I can work into my Phage or my Tiamat, whatever I feel like I need more. Ready for battle. So, Udyr did that weird back gank, so I'm going to get myself some vision right behind me, just in case. I might look to, uh... Let okay. me out. I don't want to fight him or let him get any free hits on me while he's at full rage, so... Just play that part a little bit safe. I'm going to let him push this way fully out to me. He's got the level advantage on me and full rage, so that's not Surprise, really something I want to fight. Cool. He let me get that CS where he really shouldn't have. So he's going to full lifesteal build, too, so my ignite's going to be even more it's helpful off. here. He actually went fleet footwork, which I think is kind of odd. Let's see, it's 38 to 23 CS, but I'm going to catch up all these right here. Oh, Ready. unless I clip all of my autos. Yikes. How's the team doing? Nice. Uh, mid lane got that early kill that I was talking about. Looks like bot lane's going really, really well. So yeah, Trinibir's level 6, so I am definitely not going to fight. Cool, got the cannon first. That sucks, though. My control ward's going to get killed. But nothing I can really do about that. Oh, my minion block. Ryan, why do you do this to me? <laughs> Got a nice little trade in there. Cool, he used up his fury, so I can definitely fight him now. Cool. Give it back up. 
Let's see, I got my Kakura active so I can... Look to the pieces here, keep my stuff active. Nice little hit there, pop my potion. Gonna wanna get my ward down here. Don't wanna let him... Damn, I don't have any mana. I wonder if there's a plant. Woo! I think we dive in. This is gonna push up, unfortunately. Man, I am not doing well in the CS department. There we go. It's on. Oh my nipples. I got a second here, so I can get this plant. That's perfect, and I can get this scuttler. So this wave is slow pushing out to me, so whenever that happens, you want to get vision. So I had come up to get the Rift Scuttler anyways, and I was going to put a control award up here because that spots out Gromp and Blue Buff, but that also allows the Zack to invade, which he did, and for us to follow up without losing too many minions. Trigger back, so I'm going to try and push this wave, and I need to get some mana anyways. So apparently we're playing the Assist King Jax game. I'm gonna hold on to my mana so if I need to jump I can. But gonna go definitely Ninja Tabby. I'd like to get my Trinity into a Titanic. A Bramble Vest is obviously gonna be super helpful here. Alright, so he's just gonna push those, so I'm gonna back away now. A little behind in CS, but that's cool. So I'm gonna get my Phage here and my boots. I can get another Forward. Head back to lane. Udyr's coming around, so make sure mid knows. So that's why we get that vision. Let me add him. Cool. Mid's doing pretty well. Bot lane is definitely going well. Twitch just has one kill, but that's not a big deal. Um, I think there's going to be too many minions for him to freeze there. Gonna get a ward up here. Let's see, I'm 9 CS behind, which isn't too bad. Once again, he has full fury, so we're not really looking to fight him in that. That kicks up my Conqueror right there after 4 seconds. Oh, look at that. Cool. Get a free hit in there. On my potions. Try to get him to activate his his ultimate. Keep an eye out for vision. There it is. Oh yeah! They changed it a couple seasons ago where actually uh, Jack's W gives extended attack range, even though he flashed. Able to kill him. But that was the important part. Oh, crap. I put an extra point into my Q instead of my W. That's okay. The extra cooldown is nice on that anyways. But just have to get him to use his ultimate. And then we can go in for the kill. Good shit. Well, Udyr is here anyway, so good time for me to back. I can complete my ninja tab in. Alright, Talia roamed down, but they backed up. So that's okay. Always make sure that you buy the uh, Trinibir mid. He sure is. I don't think he wants to hang out with me anymore. <laughs> I don't think Trinibir wants to play anymore. <laughs> is Udu just gonna lane against me? I don't know. 
I'm just gonna push this into pressure because he's going for a weird dragon kill. I swear this isn't bronze. So this makes it so the jungler can't join them. Cool. Got dragon. Got my conqueror up. An enemy has been I'm gonna do this to look to steal some jungle. Enemy killing spree. Uh, Trigger didn't really get anything out of that, so that's okay for me, but surprise, I'm back. I can get rid of Scuttler and establish some more safe position for myself. Alright. Oh, perfect. Udyr is still topside. I don't have any idea where Trindamir is, but this is going to push to him anyways. We set off the tower, so I'm just going to finish the shove here. Look to back. Still no signs of Trindamir. Like I said, I don't think he wants to play anymore. Cool. Get my Stinger. Head back to lane. Now the bad thing, not a bad thing to decide is whether you want Stinger or Sheed first Let either. Uh, you don't always necessarily want to go Sheed first. Sheed is great for like, when you want to do like a one quick attack. Um, like I do that when I play against Darius, for example. Uh, because it's good to get those quick attacks and get the extra damage there and disengage. Or Trigger I'll more likely be engaging in a more one-on-one -on -one scenario where we're trading auto attacks for an extended period of time. So the cooldown reduction. Uh, okay. That's much nicer. Well, he used up his fury there. So we can hold out this wave here. As soon as we see him roll, then we can shove the wave in. Udyr's bot side. So we don't have to worry about that. It's on. So just gonna punish him for the roam and keep building a CS lead. Like I said, the second I see him somewhere else, I wanna shove. You know what? I'm actually going to shove here anyways, because I want to force him to show himself, or I can put pressure on the tower. I don't have TP, so this would be fine if I had TP and I could join a fight, but since I can't... Oh, look at that. I want to just keep teasing him there. I bet I can uh, pop out his alt. Oh, I thought I would have had it. Cool. He has to leave. Cool, nice. Should be able to get first turret here. Then uh, I want to make sure that I start making some plays around the map and extending my lead. It looks like mid tower is really low. So not a bad time to try and get that. I don't know why you wouldn't build Conqueror on Trindamir. I was watching SRO's stream, and he was talking about how powerful Conqueror is on a lot of these crit-based champions like Yasuo, because they get so much more extended value out of it, because think about it this way. If he's building 100% crit, instead of doing 200 damage on auto attacks, it's doing 400, and even more of that is being converted into true damage. So... Definitely not the only answer, but a really good one to say the least. Good stuff. Nice exhaust on the Twitch. Nice heal. Live! Aww. Well, they still got two kills, so they. Oh, that's not good. Well, we'll be okay. Alright. So 
So a couple more seconds until my Conqueror goes live. Oh shit. Gotta come out mid. Can't fight three. How low is Trindamir? Ooh, dodge it out. Got my potions ticking. I can get my ultimate in just a second and go back in. Don't kill me! Nice. You have slain an enemy. Good shit. Nice collapse by the team. Cool. I didn't see if anyone actually got... Did they get Rift Herald? Oh, Zach captured it. Ha! <laughs> nice. back here. Gonna go for my Titanic Hydra next into the Rage Blade. Gonna go for a pretty super split pushy build here. Um, it wouldn't be a bad idea to build Bramble much sooner than what I am, but the Trindomir is 0-2-2. Two two. I got, what, a 30-something CS lead on him. Not really worried about him ever killing me yet. It becomes a point where it's possible, but... Yeah, Trindomir is just looking to try to regain his CS lead. I guarantee he's being a dork and going for Dragon. Oh, watch out, Zach. Trindomir is going up that way. I'm back. Alright. Well, someone's going to have to come answer for this wave, so we can back it up. Oh, find key for that. Start roaming here. One. Well then. Damn. That sucks. What do I want to sell? I accidentally did hit my E. I'm gonna sell the Dorans because then I can get Storm's Fist. Give me some more tanky stats. I wanted to collapse on Talia, but they must have had vision there. Boosted. Yeah, Twitch has got a Blade of the Ruin cake, so Bramble Vest is gonna be very good, so I am gonna want one of those. I might invest in one of those sooner and just get the Bramble component and not build it into Thornmail yet. Unless Zack builds it. If Zack builds it, then that'll be fine, too. Surprise! I'm back. Save the tower! Wow, I couldn't get to any of those? Jeez, oh, that was our brand. I thought that was someone else for a second. I'm like, ah! Good stuff. Like I said, this Trindomir is useless. He can't do anything. Yeah, we should Baron. Everyone's down. That matters, at least. We have the control ward up. Yeah. And Brand actually does percentage health, so he does a crap ton of health against um, Baron. Please, finish Baron. Please, please. What do I need to buy? I need 45 more gold. I'm gonna go jungle camp and then back.
my Titanic here. Perfect. Alright, let's see. Ready for battle. I think we split. I think I go top, they go bottom or, or mid. Because none of them can kill me. And they'll win the four uh, before. So they gotta catch Trindomir. So if they go bottom, that'll be perfect. Because they can catch that wave. I can pressure this one. Man, that Titanic is so nice for wave clear. Okay, I see two down there. There's Udir. So I don't want to get caught up in CC. If the Rift Skull is up, I can grab that and establish some vision. Bop. Or mid. Either, they need to group. Myself more vision. Yeah, Let's take my blue buff real quick. Nice. Alright, I'm just gonna group with my team because I might be able to get a flash out of this. Uh... Yep, perfect. Cool. Good engaged by the Zack. We should be able to push us no problem. See, uh, yep. That's cool. Not great that Oda died, but um, it's nice that he get brought the Twitch down to that fight, so it's easy enough for us to get the tower and the inhibitor. Easy, easy. So we got a nice wave building up top, so. Push that there. Let me add him. The CS Greed! <laughs> On my potion here. Let's back up. Oh, uh, if I can get the flash play on here. Some vision there. Ooh. Quick feet, quick feet. I didn't even see him kill the Trindomir. Oh my god. Oh god. See ya. Adios. Good way to keep building a lead is keep taking jungle camps and things like that. You really start starving your enemies for some resources. Ah, he blasted out. Damn it, I'm probably fucking dead. Fuck. I fucked up my flash jump combo there. God damn it. Whoopsies! the bramble now that's gonna be really helpful start building towards my rage blade Bring it on. all right get down to the dragon fight I need 2,000 for my rage blade That's super helpful for me. Gonna have to go to top soon. There's a huge wave building there. They try to force us mid. Alright. We see Trindomir. 
Could build just to pressure this tower. Yeah. I mean, it's only a cloud drake, so I am not too worried about that. There's the food here. Should be enough to one. Still got him. <laughs> nice. Good shit. Ah, uh, bottom. Start getting that tower. Good shit. And then someone's gonna have to go up top because we have a huge wave pushing up there, so that'll either let us get some free pressure on this top turret, or it'll be a advantage fight because there'll be a person down. Yeah, very intense, so we want to be careful. I think we're fine. Combat coach in here. Nice. Let's back up, reset. Twitch is up. He's 7, 4, and 5, so that's not a fun fight for us to take at all. Poor ooh dear. <laughs> Go back and get my Rage Blade. I'm super excited to try out this new Rage Blade. Whew! Good stiff. Alright. Up an enormous around amount of CS. But this is what happens when you manage your waves properly. So whatever way was pushing past our river, I went up and answered for it. Then rode back to fight with my team, and now I am almost 60 CS above my opponent. Ready for battle. Uh, let's see. I don't have a control ward, so I can get a... About this. It's a little risky. Drop me. Nice. Alright, sweet. Surprise. I see you, it's right in there. Oh, the damage! <laughs> but I mean, I am three levels above him. I have four and a half completed items. I am a shit touch stronger than he is. Get out of here, tower. Oh my god, I did it again. Messed up that flash jump again. So boosted. <laughs> Chase. Bring it on. That rage play feels so nice, though. And it's practically impossible to come back from three inhibitors down. You can get six super minions. And you just can't wave clear against them. Trudemir was so bad. So bad. I probably didn't even... 
throw it to my boy Odin here. Uh, probably didn't even need to build the Bramble Vest because Tryndamere was so useless. Though, the Twitch had the uh, the Blade of the Road King, so it was going to be helpful there regardless. But 11, 2, and 6. That's what's up. Let's check out damage. <sighs> the damage. Nice shit. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that one. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good jazz. Uh, don't forget, I did start Twitch streaming all of my games as well. So go ahead and check the description to find the information on that. And I definitely hope you enjoyed it. Tune in next time. Peace.